The health department has allayed fears over the increase in cases of COVID-19 in the state, saying the situation is not alarming and all the cases are mild. Altogether, 95 cases were recorded in the state on Saturday, which took the tally of active cases to 528 and one death and 27 new recoveries. The majority of the new cases were in the A and B categories. The state also recorded five deaths in the last few days, which took the death toll to 1,600. Talking to journalists, additional Secretary of Health Ram Kumar S. admitted the spike in new cases in the last few days, but added it has been a countrywide phenomenon. Stating that the new cases are of an Omicron subvariant, he said genome sequencing is being done on a regular basis. Yes, the new confirmed cases have increased in the last uh, few days. We are aware of the situation. But this has been in trend with the national uh, rise also, where there is a sub-variant of uh, Omicron, uh, which now we have the state and have the capacity of uh, genome sequencing on a regular basis, which we regularly follow, which the same sub-variant have, having the same, uh, creating uh, these issues here also. Uh, despite uh, 460 plus active cases and etc., most of them are in home isolation. Only 46 percent, 46 of them, sorry, not 47, 46 of them are in uh, category A and B of uh, you know this thing. Some of them are in C categories. Ruling out any plans to impose fresh restrictions, he said people have learned to adapt to the new norms and live with the virus. The senior health official advised people to take the vaccine and follow protocols such as avoiding large gatherings and wearing masks in public places. The main uh, precaution uh, has to be followed of uh, you know trying to uh, be you know uh, social in terms of social distancing to the maximum method possible not having big gatherings wearing masks in public places uh, and uh, most importantly, taking vaccination. It may be added that the Meghalaya government has expressed concern over the surge in COVID-19 infections and has urged citizens to follow the requisite protocols to prevent further transmission.